Good afternoon and thank you for joining me for one of my recorded fitness classes. I've tried to do this introduction about 20 times and it's infuriating because I keep on getting it wrong. So hopefully this will actually make it to the, the final edit, so to speak. So once I, once I do the introduction, I'm fine. I never ever stop it. It's just the start, I always get wrong. Um, so today, it's, um, it's going to be a relatively difficult workout, I think. I planned it yesterday. Um, I forgot what I planned. Then I had lunch not too long ago, and I'm regretting it because I think it's going to be problematic to have a belly full of food on this one. But please don't let that put you off. I think it'll be a, a half-decent workout for all of us. The only equipment you're going to need today is going to be a step. Um, so it could be your stairs or you know, a pile of books, just something to do light foot touches to. Um, later on in the workout. Aside from that, we don't need any other equipment. I don't even know if there's any ab work today. No, there is, so a mat for abs, if you've got one. Um, the same message I always have at the start of these sessions, if you're suffering from an injury or any illness, then please um, either seek medical advice first or don't take part because you know the sessions can be intense. I think this one's gonna be quite intense. Um, I don't want you to further aggravate your injury or get, get worse. Um, if you're pregnant, please again seek medical advice because a lot of these workouts aren't going to be suitable for um, someone who's pregnant. Right, I think they are all the messages. Um, you might have noticed I'm doing a different start to the session. So, <laughs> um, I don't know why I'm doing it like this. I just fancy the change. Um, so the next image you'll see will be back to normal. We'll be cracked straight on with the warm up. So, get yourself ready. See you in a second. Right, let's get warmed up. Jog on the spot. Again, nice and warm for this workout. The first workout, I'm going to start with a river bang. Be very short, hard workouts. You'll be pleased to know. Get the hard stuff out of the way first. Okay, wide stance, punching out. Side to side punching. And on the spot. Just increase the pace slightly. Wide start, punching out. And side to side punching. Okay, back and jogging on the spot. Wide start, punching out. And side side punching. Okay, it's going to five squats, five press ups, and then star jumps. You can't do star jumps, just do normal high knees. Oh god, my legs are kidding. Ow! I have no idea why my Alexa just, just went off there. So, five squats, five press ups. We've done those back in the star jumps. Okay, this round, eight squats, eight press ups, and then star jumps again. 
I did a workout yesterday which was um, quite leg intensive. That's why a bit sore. I'm sure they'll warm up though. Right, I think that's it. So eight press ups. Then start jumps again. Okay, last round. Ten squats, ten press ups. So 10 of each. And start jumps. So nice and fast. First workout is one where I kind of leave you to your own devices. So what I want you to do, you might want some music playing. Um, so I'm not going to add any music to this this workout. So get your own music. Just have something that's going to keep you focused for five minutes. That's all the workout's going to be. Okay, I'll see you in a, a second for the start of the workout. Right, workout number one. This is a simple workout. All I'm going to ask you to do is 50 burpees as fast as you can. So burpees, I want you to do your hardest variation, whether that be chest to floor burpees or a standard burpee. Just test yourself, okay? Um, so we all know what burpees are, but I'll demonstrate anyway. So your standard burpee, hands down, legs back, forward, and we jump and we clap above our head. Chest to floor burpee, hands down, chest to floor, up, and jump. Just realised my top is incredibly short, so you can probably see my stomach every single time I do a jump. That's going to get me self conscious, isn't it? <laughs> okay, um, I said 50 burpees, I think that was kind of a lie. If you're doing chest to floor, it's 50 burpees. If you're choosing standard, they are much easier. So I expect you to do 60 of those. If you're doing it on a race surface, so you're on a, say you're using a chair, so you don't have to go down to the floor, then you need to do 70. There's a five minute cutoff. So if you haven't finished in five minutes, just record where you are um, and note that down somewhere for future reference. Oh. So that, that pauses me going, oh great, I've got to do this workout now. So just do it as fast as you can. I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. Let me have a drink of water. Nervous drink. It's only five minutes, isn't it? I did this um, God, a few years ago, as fast as I could. But since then, I can't do, um, I have to do burpees on my, on my knuckles now, because I've got bad wrists. And they're just much slower. So I'm gonna, hopefully I'll get in the five minute time gap, you never know. Right, okay, let's do this. 10 seconds, 50 burpees as fast as you can. Wait for the beat. Two, one, let's go.
ठीक है Got two minutes. Two minutes left. Keep it going as fast as you can. Come on. I'll try and stand up in a minute. One and a half minutes. Just keep that speed best you can. Just limit any rest. Try and get the 50 done. If you can't, record where you reach. You've got just over a minute left. One minute. Okay, flat out. Do not worry about the rest of the day session. Focus on this. Fast to the end. Got 45 seconds. Thirty-five seconds left. Come on, 30 seconds. Keep going to the end. If you finish, well done. If not, keep pushing. You've got 15 seconds. Come on, every single rep count. 10. Come, you're almost there. 5. 2. One, and rest. Good work. Awesome work. Whew. Well, recall what time you got, um, or what rep you got to, and do that again another time and see how you compare. Oh, that's tough. It's hard to make yourself do, isn't it? Keep them going. I managed two minutes 38. So if you beat my time, well done. If you didn't, there's your target for future. Oh. And if you do beat it, let me know, I'm interested. Oh. Yeah, so I started going to um, burpees on my knuckles, which makes it not harder, but when you do flat hands, I was able to just literally drop to the floor and land on my hands and go back up again. But doing enough was you have to put your hands down um, so you lose a bit of time. But I can't do the normal ones anymore, so when I've tried, I just overbalance and I tip forwards and I'm head up the floor. So it's not great. Right. Well done for doing that one. We're going to move on to the cardio-based workout next. Um, oh yeah, this is where you need your step. Um, so get your stairs or step handy, and we'll crack on once you've got that sorted and I've got my step out. So, see you in a sec. Workout number two. Cardio-based, we've got four exercises, 30 seconds on each exercise before we move on to the next one. We're doing four rounds of this. So first exercise is your mountain climbers. Um, hopefully we know what mountain climbers are. Hands down, both legs, knee towards the chest. Oh, tell you what, my, I don't feel too good after those burpees. Right, that's exercise number one. Number two is gonna be our jumps. So we're gonna simply jump up in the air, we're gonna land lightly and have a small cushioning jump before we jump again. So jump, cushion. Jump, cushion, jump, cushion. The reason we do that cushion jump is if you just simply jump and jump, bring a lot of pressure on your knees when you land. At least if we land lightly on our toes and hop up again, just taking some of that, that pressure off. 
Third exercise, quick step, so it's jumping, light, just light touches on your step. Fourth exercise, running high knees. Right, well, move that out of the way. I'm hoping that um, I, I recover a bit during this workout. I feel a little bit dizzy, which is pretty <laughs> bad for a two and a half minute workout. Okay, so we've got 10 seconds, well, in second, mountain climbers, jumps, quick steps, running high knees. 30 seconds, then you've got five seconds to transition to move to your next movement. So you'll hear a beep at the end of the 30 seconds and another beep at the start of the next 30. So 10 seconds, mountain climbers. So four rounds in total. Get ready, down, two, one, and mountain climbers. Try and keep it unbroken. That means we don't stop. Okay, to your feet. Jump to next. Two, one, let's go. Jump cushion, jump cushion. If you can't do jumps, sorry, punching out. Should have said that start, sorry. And rest. Quick steps. Go. Running high knees next, running on the spot. Let's go. Start if you're able. I'm struggling actually, let's keep it, keep it fast. Ten seconds. Five. And rest. Mountain climbers. Start of round two. Let's go. Okay, to your feet, jump to next, or boxing fast feet. Let's go. Steps next. Let's go. Keep it fast.
Got it. Okay, high knees. Jog on the spot. Let's go. As fast as you're able. Five seconds. And rest. Halfway. Master climb is next. Get down. And go. To your feet, jump to next. Let's go. Get those knees high. And rest. Quick steps. Uh, go. First. Drop on the spot. Let's go. Go on faster. Ten seconds. Five. And rest. Last round, mountain climbers. Go! Okay, to your feet, jump to next. Go. Knees high. Ten seconds. Rest. Quick sets. Go. Keep it fast. Last one, high knees. Good. Come on, fast to the end. Make it hard for yourself. Good. 
come on. Ten seconds, faster. And rest. Oh, well done. Okay, a couple minutes rest. Oh. See, um, the jumps are quite, quite the challenge. Oh. The next workout, you're going to need your mat, as there are some sit-ups involved. I'm not sure how hard it will be the next workout. Hopefully a challenge for us all. Right, we've got one minute and then I'm going to go through the workout. Or probably less than that. I'm getting a drink and then um, we'll talk through the workout. Okay, right, the uh, third workout. This is going to be an AMRAP, a nine minute AMRAP. So as many reps, as many rounds as we can do in that nine minute period. So I've got four exercises. First one is going to be 10 um, squat star jumps. So we're just going to come down, touch our toes, and then we're going to jump up, down, like so. So 10 of those, followed by six bird get up planks. So bird get up planks, for those who haven't done them before, we've got hands down, legs go back as we were doing the burpee, so in that high plank position, we go down onto our forearms, back up onto our hands, jump, clap above our heads, one of the, I mean that's one rep. So six of those, Try and alternate the arm that you lead down on on the get up planks. Right, the next exercise is going to be 10 hand release press ups. So, very similarly, you're going to do press ups to the floor, hands off the floor, and up. Down, hands up, like so. Fourth exercise sit ups, full sit ups. So, we're going to touch the ground behind us, come up. Touch our toes, and you'll do 15 repetitions of that. So, 10 of the squat to star jump, 6 bed to get up planks, 10 hand release press ups, 15 sit ups. Right, so 9 minutes, going in 10 seconds. Um, I'll try my best to talk through the workout as we're going, but as I'll be working out, Sometimes I lose track. So if you do want to write it down, pause now and I'll go through the workout one more time before we start. So pause now. Okay, hopefully you've unpaused. <laughs> so the workout's 10 squat star jumps, 6 bird get up planks, 10 hand release press ups, 15 sit ups. Going in 10 seconds, 9 minute workout. I've not done this before, so I don't know how it's going to affect us, but hopefully it'll be fine. So 10, squat star first. Ready, let's go. Then it's six bed to get our planks. Alternate the arm. You lead down on it. When you've done those, it's ten hand release press ups. Then it's 15 sit ups.
When you've done those, that's round one done. Just keep repeating. So 10 squat star again. And six bed, get up planks. And 10 press ups, hand release press ups. Keep repeating. Uh, four minutes left. Keep it going, last few minutes.
Oh, one minute left. Keep going. Come on, almost there. Ah, 15 seconds. Ah, tough, one more. Ah, and rest. Ah, oh, well done. Oh. I felt quite fatigued against that one. Not bad that workout though. If you don't to use your core, then they both get up planks and also those press ups. The sit ups become much harder. Whew. I have no idea how I'm doing for time. I've got another workout which we're going to do, but I might shorten it to do one round instead of two, which I will do, I think. But I'll give you the option. I'll tell you what I had planned, and you can do the extra bit if you want. So I need this, yeah. You need max up. It's a core workout. Right. We'll all get a drink before we start there. So do the same if you want. And we're going to start in um, about 30 seconds. Right, the final workout is going to be a core workout. We've got one, two, three, four, five. I've got six exercises for you. So let me adjust my interval timer. Right, that's ready. We're going to do 50 seconds of work for 10 seconds rest. So, first exercise is going to be a walkout. So that's where we bend at the hips, hands to the floor, walk your hands out as far as they can go, and back up to your standing position. Second one, leg raises. So lying down, hands under your bum for support, legs up, they hover just above the ground, and up. If you need to, you can do this one a single leg. Right, third exercise, a plank jack. So plank on our forearms, but our legs jump out to the side and back in. So plank your forearms, legs jump out, jump in, out, in. Next one, clap sit-ups. So legs in the air, reach up behind and touch behind your legs. Okay, fifth exercise is a plank, your normal plank, 
So you should know that one. Hope you can see me from here. And then the uh, last one is going to be cycle twist sit-ups. So your knees swell with sit-ups. I'll probably move the camera down actually. See if you can see me any better. It's probably totally wonky now. Okay, so we're gonna do one round of this. If you, um, I think it's gotta go down now. If you want to do two rounds, have a short break after the six exercises and do another round that do 40 seconds of work and 10 seconds rest. So first round is 50 seconds of work, 10 seconds rest. One, another one, drop it to 40. Right, first exercise is your walkouts. You've got 10 seconds. You probably can't see my head now, so I move the camera down, but you'll see me when I do the four exercises. Two, one, okay, down, let's go. As far as you can go, and then back up. Fifteen seconds. Almost there. Okay, rest. Leg raises. For five seconds, get ready. Two, one, go. Fifteen seconds. Okay, rest. Right, plank jacks. Plank your forearms and legs out to the side. Two, one. Let's go. Okay, rest. Clap sit-ups. Oh, they're quite hard, aren't those clap jacks? Okay, let's go. Legs in the air. And rest. Okay, normal plank. Plank your forearms. Two, one, let's go. Only two exercises left. 
I found his clap sit ups pretty hard. And some of his hairs in there. Ten seconds. Oh, and rest. Well done. Well done, okay. So, uh, that's it. Let me take this. Right. Okay. Well, that's it for today's workout. Um, as I said, if you want to do it again, if you want to do the last workout, chop it down to 40 seconds for 10 seconds rest. And, um, well, for me, that's it though. Thank you for joining me and I'll see you next time. Thank you.